Well, tonight, a South Florida woman is accusing her homeowners association of towing away her late husband's cars. Local 10 News investigator Jeff Weins here confronted the HOA president and has the story from Plantation. We heard him fall. I screamed his name. He didn't respond. 59-year-old Richard Coosley died of a sudden heart attack. So I was planning a funeral, planning a viewing, getting my sister-in-law here from Jamaica. The last thing on her mind was Richard's cars parked in the parking lot. The couple has lived here at the Plantation Racket Club on Broward Boulevard for 20 years. Imagine you wake up on the morning of your husband's funeral and their cars are gone. Richard's two black Dodge Chargers towed by his homeowners association. They're now at all county towing, accruing hundreds of dollars in fees that rise daily and it's money this teacher's aide simply doesn't have. Dory says she called the HOA president, who she says authorized the tows. She knew he died. She knew we were planning a funeral. She didn't call anybody about anything. But you knew he died. I heard the rumors around the property. If I listened to the rumors around here, I'd get nothing done ever. State records show Susan Seaman, or Sam as she's known, is the condo president. Well, I can't talk to you any further than I've already talked to you except to tell you the frickin' rules. Okay. She knew what. She decided to say... Seaman says cars cannot be parked in the same guest spots for over a month, and her claim is that Richards were. She told us that the cars were in the same spot for a month. No. What I think is that she has rules for certain people and not other people. Coosley and other residents agree there is definitely selective enforcement. They point to this Honda Prelude in a guest spot. It has expired tags, spider webs on the wheels. Residents we talked to say it hasn't moved for months. If the rules are the same, why hasn't the Prelude been? I can't answer that. I have to talk to my security guard. There's this Chevy Trailblazer in a guest spot with a flat tire. Residents also say it hasn't moved. Well, that one will be taken care of, too. Right. And the owners of these motorcycles in guest spots haven't moved them either. There's a situation going on there, so we gave them more time. There was certainly a situation going on in Dory Coosley's life when Richard's cars were towed. All she had to do was make a phone call. A malicious, vindictive person who has no soul and no heart. That's how I totally feel, because no one in their right mind would have done that to anybody. So Calvin and Nicole, we actually reached out to All County Towing. We explained the circumstances. The owner, Chris Casal, he was awesome. He said not only would he waive all of the fees, he would also return the cars. But what he's actually going to do is help her sell the cars so she can use the money for expenses, which is what she ultimately wants to do. We're live in Plantation. Jeff Weins here, Local 10 News.